Hello guys, silver butterflies here. I just will show you uh, the samples hole uh, for brief. This is uh, Maison Francisco Cajan, L'Homme à la Rose. This is men's cologne or perfume from Cajan. And I would love to do the video. This is uh, Cartier, Scarat. I did the video before, but it was long ago, it was when it was launched. Now I have a second sample, so I can make a review, uh, maybe with a different twist. This is irresistible. I also made a review, but I will smell it again because I forgot it. This is the one uh, of my dreams, uh, to have uh, Cartier La Panthère Parfum. And uh, I keep postponing to buy. <laughs> and. Uh, Otherwise, I just want it as a gift. I have two samples here. Maybe that would be enough for me, but the border is something else. This is Pentaligons, Pinhaligons. Each time I say Pentaligons, Pinhaligons, Artemisia. Lovely. I think I made review for Artemisia and I made review for Cairo. I, I appreciate this one. It's quite strong. I think it's more for summer. No, more, no more for winter than summer. It's way too strong for women. But maybe this a La Par Eau de Parfum Cartier. This one is uh, Miss Dior. Uh, the beauty of uh, grass rose wrapped in ribbon of fresh notes and woven with lovely rosewood. Uh, the modern confident femininity of sensual flora. I want to try that one, that's new. Kenza Walt Yellow. I had, I think, the green one, the first one. This is Francis Corkshan Amiris for men. Oh, it's unisex. Uh, this one is uh, Kenzo flower nowadays. I used to have the original one long ago, and now I think they're celebrating it 20 years anniversary. This is Lancelot D. Givenchy, the light version. I compare them uh, with uh, the original one, not the original long ago, 53, 1953 just recent one and they gave me also this Le Nouveau Perfume the underground flower a sway flower infused with black leather vanilla wow <laughs> this is just mine and I bought this perfume that's quite heavy and another one is uh, Derek Lamb uh, look at this giant 175 mil and it's enough for the whole army <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do with this amount but I could share with someone uh, if someone live in here in Toronto <laughs> because I don't know how to to send it to my sister for instance that's quite heavy to send it by the mail it will be too much <laughs> You're gonna pay for mail more than you paid for the perfume. So they also gave me uh, these two samples, Tiffany and Co. Love for her. Uh, also, Burberry, two pieces. This new one, or the perfume. I think I'm dreaming to have uh, the dark version 2020. I forgot the name, but I think it's Intense. This is Nomad. I know this perfume, but it's better to refresh in mind. Same as Chloe Lo. Uh, it's funny enough, I don't have any bottles of Chloe in my house, although it's a very good brand, I don't know why. <laughs> but I have lots of samples, so that's why maybe I don't have enough time and, you know, body <laughs> to use it all. And this, of course, epiphany of everything. I probably will do review. So, 
this is Givenchy. So all the best guys, bye for now, more later. I'm your silver butterfly. Did I show you the, the purchases? So this one I got it for. It will be a separate review, so take care and bye for now. I'm your silver butterfly. So I decided to put it all inside. So you can see all the samples. Keep this away uh, for nearest review. So this is uh, my uh, perfume samples haul just uh, for yesterday so this is my bragging point <laughs> go to the store and they maybe give you something else bye for now more later i'm your silver butterfly